<clears throat> What's up, you guys? So this message isn't going to be for everybody. There is somebody that needs to be warned. Um, something's coming full circle for somebody because they are going to attempt to put mushrooms, those poisonous mushrooms that we've been pulling on in somebody's food in a room. I think it's a hotel room. So let's just see what this is. All right, let's see. Tell me about this situation here with the mushrooms. Um, okay. So investing in, what's that? Investing in, okay, working together with, this, this could be something where, hold on, with, all right, this, I don't know if uh, somebody could be investing time and collaborating with somebody that they should have closed the cycle out with. So I don't know if <clears throat> this person could have been warned about this this person. Give me a name of the person who's investing and, and working together with someone that, um, give me the name of the person who should have closed out a cycle and just stopped dealing with someone because this may actually happen to them for not doing that. Give me, thank you, G or D. D or S, heavy D. Heavy D. N, A, or P, I. This almost looks like kidnap. And it, G, D, N, P, A, I, S. All right, let's get some more information about this. So tell me about the person on the end that has the mushrooms. Tell me about this person. Thank you. Could be a fire sign, but this is somebody that uh, is very jealous and intimidated of a divine feminine here. I don't know if they want to do this to you, divine feminine. <sighs> somebody, yeah, that's what they're going to do. They're going to attack somebody in the home. I think that whoever this is for, you need to put your guard up with this with this relationship. You need to, um, you're gonna, I mean, uh, defend yourself, protect yourself in a home with this person. Tell me more about this. It's weird. It's just weird. I don't, I'm, I, it feels like somebody's with somebody that they know they shouldn't be with, and. I don't know if this person was told or warned to like, you know, stop dealing with this person. It's what it looks like. This is somebody who's going to reap what they sow for working together with somebody that they should have stopped dealing with here. And unfortunately, it may be that this person winds up putting those mushrooms in somebody's friggin' food. You are a solid individual. Like, I don't even think that I could ever tip you over. So whoever the, the other person is on the other side, they're a solid person. But the person that they're in a relationship with or live in a home with, I don't know if this is roommates or or uh, Taurus. So either you're a solid person, Taurus. Somebody could have been trying to do this to you. But I also feel like that this could be a, a, someone's in a relationship with someone who's married and they were warned about this person. So now what? There could be a Taurus that's actually a good person here, a Hierophant. This is somebody that's offering information, like solid information. So this, you could be the person, Taurus, who's offering this information to somebody saying, yo, I would stop dealing with this person because they are, and then fill in the blanks. And somebody's, I guess this is going to be somebody's karma for not, for not listening, trying to electrocute you. Uh-oh. Is this somebody doing this shit in your home or in your home? A male? Or are they, is it, hold on a second. I got to see something here. Hold on a second. Okay. Okay. 
sophisticated groups in the room. Okay. Um, how did you get there? What's going on? It's a male trying to electric follows you when you leave the house. Are you kidding me? This is weird. Hold on a second. Okay. So you could be a Taurus. Male. All right, somebody that you're in a relationship with or some kind of commitment with. I don't know if, if they're following you because they think that you're you're cheating. For somebody, you may be cheating and somebody knows. Give me some initials for whoever's try, trying to electrocute someone. Trying to electrocute you. Give me some initials for this, please. Or initially somebody was, was sent to your home to try to do that shit. There could be... There could be a situation where initially somebody came to try to mess with the electric to try to electrocute somebody. Wow. And now I guess because it says initially this person doesn't want to anymore or you could have... Uh, come, give me initials for the trying to electrocute you, please. John could mean something, C or M, that could be Michael. If it's the male. Or that their letters start, yeah, M or I, it's on Michael again, M, C, and M, I. M, C, I, I don't know what, oh, hold on a second. Okay. All right. Concern. Let, let me. I want to. I want to find some shit out. I don't want to waste your time on camera. So I'm gonna pause it and I'm gonna find something. I'll be right back. All right. There's a chick named Piper that got exposed for sleeping with someone's husband. If it's not a Taurus, who was the one that exposed this? It's somebody who is tapped in. This is reliable information with the Hierophant and the of Cups. This is truth. This is when somebody speaks something, they're not bullshitting. Okay? So this chick got exposed for sleeping with somebody else's husband. So she, I don't think this happened yet, but she was planning on being behind sending someone named Michael Freya. You both better back the fuck up, okay? Or don't and see what happens. But she was going to send this dude to um, with the room to try to electrocute somebody. You understand? You can't just walk into, if this is a hotel room, you can't just walk into a fucking hotel and ha and mess with the electrical in someone's hotel establishment. You're animals. You're like little hyenas. So I guess now, I guess what, what I want to do is I want to pull on just a few cards on both of these people and see what kind of secrets they got. All right? Piper, you should have kept your legs closed, darling, all right? Because it feels like you got caught doing some shit. Uh, it feels like maybe you are the one that's reaping what the fuck you so, mama, uh, because you are collaborating with somebody that you knew you shouldn't have been messing with, okay? And what that messing with was is somebody that you knew that somebody is married. You understand? You don't get to, you don't get to cheat with a married man, okay? And then uh, when you get caught or it gets exposed and you get to attack the person who exposed it, you're, you're the problem. You are. Tell me about this chick, um, Piper. What, what's up with Piper? Tell me, tell me about Piper. Time to pay to Piper. That's what it is, too. You got to pay to Piper. Hmm? Blocked. What's up? Piper. Concern and Piper. Hmm? Tablespoon. Why is that? Do you shoot up, Piper? Hold on a second. So you're shooting up dope. Okay. Yeah, you cheated with a married man. Good. And you're mad that somebody else exposed this. So you want to try and have somebody electrocuted because you can't keep your legs closed? Or a needle out of your arm, ma'am? Yeah. You will not do that because you will be watched. Tell me about Piper. 
Tell me about Piper. What do we need to know about this broad here? Hmm? Blocked. So this person could have actually, or it's going to be blocked because I'm, I'm exposing it. Or this person could have put graveyard dirt in someone's food as well. Did Piper do this? Okay. Somebody put graveyard dirt in this female's food, and that could be why if she's like uh, flipping out or she's on, somebody's doing spell work on this chick. Tell me who put the graveyard dirt in, in the food. Tell, tell me who put graveyard dirt in, in this chick's food, please. P or E, this could be Pete. Pedro, Pete. Hold on a second. Yeah. Somebody named Pete. So that's the one. So I don't know because it feels like maybe they're trying to tell me that this chick is acting more irrational than she normally would. Now, between the fact that she's making bad decisions and needs to take accountability for that shit, she's also shooting up drugs. But she could be really out of character, and it would be because somebody's doing this and then pop breaks in people's homes. Are you, is this chick, if you, I don't know if you watch my channel, Piper, but if you're acting in ways that you don't understand, it's because somebody near you is putting graveyard dirt in your damn food and doing spell work. It feels like some necromancy type of shit. So you need to cut that person off. Whoever is putting the shit in your food, Piper, which it looks like it's somebody named Pete. You were supposed to, you were probably warned about this person, possibly from the same person who exposed, you know, I don't know if you were dating this dude, or I don't even know if, she's, if she watches, but if this chick was dating somebody, maybe named Pete, and then slept around with somebody else, he could have blocked her, or something like that, but it just feels um, like it's your fault, Aquarius, somebody's an Aquarius in this situation. This is Piper, though, I asked about. Hold on. No, you were supposed to, Piper, if you watch my channel, what are you doing? Stop eating food that this dude raped. Hold on a second. Breaks in people's homes? Are you, is, is this girl connected to a dude that breaks in homes and rapes women? Hold on a second. Is that what you're telling me? This Pete? Okay, hold on a second. They want me to get a last name for this punk. Yo, for the female who was trying to have another female... Uh, yeah, you let this person treat you like an object, like you're less than human. You understand? You will never, ever be able to electrocute somebody, bitch, when you are messing with dudes who do this shit. So you're, are you sleeping with this? I'm going to get his last name for, for the detectives and the police, but let's see something here. Oh, yeah, you picked the wrong one today. We'll be right back, bitch. This dude, Pete's last name is Crut. K-R-U-T. All right. It feels to me like there's a woman. No, I'm sorry, because a woman wouldn't do this. There's a chick. Wow, you're a, you're really something, man. Just because this female thought about having this done to a woman when you fucked up shit, you're going to get something come to you for this shit. Because it ain't going to happen to whoever this woman is. You understand? She's protected. You, on the other hand, though, ma'am, are not. Let's find out some more about these dingbats. This chick was going to try and... I don't. I think she just wants to get back at somebody. So she could be going through all kinds of ways. Like, okay, with the room. This person lives... Or you live in a house. Or, or for some of you, for somebody, this could be a roommate. And they're doing this in the room next to you. Just put a house fits or It's not for... It's just ain't going to be for everybody. There's a bitter bitch... <clears throat> who makes real bad decisions and got caught. And... This chick now is trying to figure out a way to get back at this woman. When the whole time, the person that she's connected to somehow is putting graveyard dirt in her food. I think it's like trying to get her to facilitate something. She could be having nightmares or just confusion, not being able to get out of the house, like taking forever to get ready and stuff like that. It's because, it's, you know. Oh, my God. Tell me more about this chick or... Michael, Freya, Pete, I don't know who these people are, but you better try to ruin your reputation. 
So so let me get this straight. Let let's let's factor this in. There's a female who tried to ruin another female's reputation, but you're sleeping with married men, shooting up, hanging with people who rape women, molested as a child, and intimidate a witness. I don't think so. Like, please don't sit there and tell me that because this female possibly was molested or touched as a child that she, she feels like that she has the right to do this shit to other women. This is somebody who's really broken. I would hope at first that this chick would actually get her shit together and heal. Um, maybe she will. Yeah, judgment. Yeah, uh-huh. First off, your judgment is way off, ma'am. Because if you, if you're, if this is the judgment call that you're making is to hang out with men who break in people's homes, put graveyard dirt in people's food, intimid, like to intimidate people and rape women and electrocute them and possibly be, this could be the same one with the mushrooms and the, you need to check yourself, bitch, is what you need to do. All right. Tell me about this. I don't even know what to say here. T tell me about this rape, breaking people's home. Well, tell me about this. You nasty motherfucker, you. 16, 16, look at you. Jealous, vengeful. Who's this towards? Who, who's this jealous energy towards, man? It's got to be a divine feminine. Who's who's this jealous energy towards? It's got, it's, tell me who, who this energy is towards, please. Some message came out. And she's mad. And the message is that, is that she's sleeping with a married man. So now what? Hmm? Oh, is that a business? Somebody stressed out about a large sum of money? Is that, what, what is that doing here? Hold on a second. Okay. This, this is a hit. So there's a hit on somebody. Give me an initial for who the hits on. Another one bites the dust. Is that what they're saying? Is that why they're putting dust up? Hey, she gonna get you too. Another one bites the dust. Yeah, Piper, you made a big mistake, darling. And so do these dingbat rapists you hang with. Hmm? I tell you what, you break into the wrong person's home, you wind up getting your face blown off. Be careful doing that shit. So you let this woman lets lets men take advantage of her, and she tried to ruin someone else's reputation. Hmm? Somebody could have lied and even said that they were molested as a child to try to um, like have people accept their actions of this woman. Give me some letters for this gel who the other person is, please. Give me some letters of some first names, H or N, C or B. Head bitch in charge is what I see too. Divine feminine. E or S. H C E. Let's see what this is. What does that say? Nathan. N H. I asked about the person on the other side though. Nathan, right? Not the person on the other side. No, clear that from me. Spirit. Is this person involved too? Oh, you're going to wind up dying. Every one of you motherfuckers. So we got Pete. We got Michael. We got Nathan. I'm sure that there's more. There's possibly a Sean with the S-E here. Every one of you who are trying to set somebody else up. Are they still trying to set up a woman to get raped? Are you in, out of your minds? Clear that from me. Spirit. Are they still trying to set a woman up to get raped? Clear that from me, Spirit. Detective's gonna do something about this. You're fucked. HCE. You people are so sick. Let me guess. Every one of these people made horrible decisions. They're probably drug addicts with the tablespoon. They're shooting up. They're probably going through karma for being shitty people because of the way that they're treating people and because of this drug, right? Or something's going on. So let, 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 let's clear this up. So you guys make horrible decisions and you're getting your ass whooped by karma. I don't even need that card to be out here. And you are mad at somebody else because of your fucking decisions? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Nathan, you're screwed, buddy. What is this? 
Horse cock energy. Oh my god, I can't. I can't. I'm disgusted. Yo, I'm done. Let me find out at the detective because I'm going to get everybody's last name. Everybody's. So we got Michael Freya. Hold on a second. Play that for me, Spirit. Do, do the detectives know who Piper is? Yeah, you're fucked, bitch. Um, let's do this. Hold on. Clear that from the spirit. The name of Pete. Okay, I got Pete's last name. And, um, do they have Nathan's last Let's get Nathan's last name. I'll be right back, you sick motherfuckers. Nathan Rivas. His name's possibly, uh, R-I-V as in Victor A-S. You are all screwed. Um... Something bad's gonna happen to these people. Some of them may actually be wind up getting locked up. There's a possibility some of these people's phones were already tapped. If not, because of this message coming out now, they're not gonna you're not even gonna stand a chance doing this shit to this woman. I wish that anybody trying to set up anybody to be raped lose their life. That's my wish. Because you foul and you don't even deserve to be here nowhere. Fuck off, Philly out.